guys, good morning. This is Faithful with Elegance for Less. I am so excited to be back with you guys on a Tuesday morning. So thank you so much for joining me on Tuesday morning for coffee, tea, quick encouraging word, and I have a haul for you. Okay, so lately I've been doing these really small hauls, but I have a good one for you today. And like I mentioned in my other video, I had my girlfriend here for two weeks. It's just been so much going on. Um, my son got engaged, so we had a dinner and planning that. And then we had our Easter dinner with friends and family. I want to say it was 36 of us, including children. And so that was um, work and time. So I am sorry, I did take some time off to hang out with my girlfriend, but also I had other things that was going on. But I am happy to be back, and thank you guys for tuning in. If this is your first time to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for spending this time with us. I do have breakfast, and I know it's been a while since I've had breakfast with you guys. So if you are gonna have breakfast with me, this is a perfect time to grab your breakfast. I've got my coffee, and I already took my sip. I'm gonna take another sip. I've got pineapple, toast, and omelet. I have a mushroom cheese bacon and ham omelet and fresh um, salsa with cilantro on top. And I am going to take a bite. So my encouraging word for us today is take one day at a time. One day at a time. And there is a little song as I'm saying that that's ringing in my mind, one day at a time, sweet Jesus. But one day at a time knowing that every day has its own problems. Every day has its own provision. Every day is already set for us before the foundation of the earth. Now I'm not saying that because our days are already laid out for us that we don't plan and we're not productive. But I would encourage you not to worry about tomorrow, not to bring yesterday into today because today has its own provision it has its own set of situation that we will have to deal with and i must tell you seriously honestly i've been practicing this i've been choosing to live this way because i find that as i begin to walk in this direction I'm able to relax more and I'm able to get today task accomplished without stressing over tomorrow or what I didn't get done yesterday. And so this is my encouraging word for you today is let us begin to see today, you know, live in the moment today. And that means you have to choose to respond to certain things or choose to let go. And I oftentimes find that when I'm living in today, I let go because I definitely want to be able to experience what God had planned for this day. And I'm not saying that things don't, don't come in. I mean, the enemy is obviously real and he's going to be the opposition to God. He wants to block everything that God is doing. God does everything that's good and perfect comes from God and the enemy, he comes to kill, steal and destroy. So there is conflict there. And so yes, things are gonna occur out of your control and then there are things going to be that is in your control. 
I am saying let's choose wisely and know that we have today. We can choose to make it an amazing day by the way we respond to th certain things, by the way that, um, how kind, I should say, how kind we decide that we want to be to others. And always, always be a person that is generous. I've shared with you guys before about generosity. It is part of the foundation in receiving a harvest. When you're generous, you sow bountifully, you will reap bountifully. So let us live in today and allow tomorrow to take care of itself because tomorrow has its own provision. It has its own set of troubles. And today we can deal with just today. All right, I hope that that was encouraging for you. We'll jump into a quick prayer. God, we thank you so much that you know everything. You orchestrate every area of our lives. You said you knew where we would live before we were even formed. You knew our friends, you knew our spouse, you knew our children because you are the creator. You know everything about us, Lord. We're grateful for that. We thank you that you have a plan for each and every single one of us and that we can rest in knowing no matter what tomorrow brings, no matter what we're experiencing today, it will not overtake us unless we allow it to because the plans you have for us is for good and never for disaster. If we can lock that into our hearts and know that your plan is for good and never for disaster. We will not stress, we will not fret, we will trust you, Lord God, that you will work today out for our good and for your glory. We love you, we thank you, we give you all the praise, the glory, and the honor, because you and you alone are worthy, Lord. Oh, I thank you, Jesus, for your goodness and your mercy. We thank you, Lord God, for giving us your son, your precious son, to be an example for us in Jesus Christ's name. Amen. Okay, let's jump right into this haul. I want to share quickly. I did go to the Dollar Tree and haul a few things, and I didn't share, I'm not going to share all of them with you because I want to use them as DIYs. So um, I want to share with you these little pillows though, because this is the first time I've seen them, and I thought, how perfect are these? So um, they're a dollar each. I love the colors and I love the uh, theme of them, the fur. So I also want to share with you, if you do not know about the Dollar Tree, the Dollar Tree has bins that they clearance out. So you would think it's a dollar. What do you mean clearance out? They do do 50% sales. So I want you to know if there's a little chip or just like a regular store, they have clearance out things. Like for Valentine's Day, they clearance that out. Um, some of their spring items, they'll clearance that out as well. So the Dollar Tree also have clearances if you didn't know that little fact. Okay, so I went to, I didn't open this. I went to Burlington Coat Factory. And Mother's Day's coming up and I'm thinking Tablescape already. They have these little cupcake stands. How perfect is that? I thought that would be wonderful for a Tablescape for Mother's Day. And so there is four in a pack and they're cupcake holders. And so I got two of them because I need eight for my tablescape. And they were $6.99, originally $9.99. So I got two of them. Then they had this little greenery, I loved it. And they clearanced it out for $3.99, originally $6.99, so that was a great buy. You know that there is no way Bells will not be on my list. Well, Bells is on my list. And I went to Bells and this was Friday and they had a sale on these. I thought they were beautiful. 
not necessarily want to keep them for my home, but they are these really nice canvas. And I thought for the price, I've never found canvas at this price, so I can always paint over this canvas. And they were 65 cents each. So I hauled three of each of them, 65 cents. How wonderful is that? So I got three of each from Bell's Outlet. Now I've shared this with you guys before. I will say it again. Mondays are for seniors and Fridays are for people that are under 50. Also, this is a perfect time to go shopping. Walmart is clearancing out. They should be at 75 now, if not 80. Um, 70 or 80 now. They usually clearance out their summer, their spring items about a week after uh, Easter is over. So now they should be running their sales. Same for Joann's and Michael's. So if you're not familiar with that, you didn't know about the sales, the sales should be going on now where you get 70% off. So I went to Joann's and they had the end of spring theme. Actually, it's called the door, the garden. It's called the garden. That's the, in the garden. That's the theme. The theme is called in the garden. And so they had all these mats clearanced out from $14.99 and you get 70% off plus you Michaels had a Michael had a 20% additional off so I was able to take advantage of that as well so I was very happy they have this little sign as well and it says see the beauty in everything so I love that and that's something I definitely strive to do it was uh, $19.99 and you got 70% off and 70% off and 20, an additional 20% off this is the flag that goes with I can open that because I'm gonna put it outside I thought this was fabulous because I can use it now even though it's somewhat spring but I think it definitely can go into summer so I'm just dropping everything there this is the flag it matches the mat and I want to say um, let's see how much this was the flag was $12.99 and you got 70% off of that these are dish towels and they are $9.99 each and 70% off. So I love that. I thought that would be perfect for Mother's Day with the colors. I forgot to mention that I did find this at Bell's as well. And it was 65 cents and I got three of them. That is my haul for today. It is getting warm out here. I am so glad you guys tuned in with me. I am going to, oh, one last thing. I'm sorry. I love these plant hangers. I hauled four of them because they actually worked out to be $4 a piece. So um, they are originally $14.99 and you get 70% off plus 20. And I just thought, it was wonderful. It's the metal is heavy. It's really a nice addition for your garden if you're going to start gardening for summer or even for spring. So that's it for my haul. Thank you guys so much for joining me and I will see you later on with a DIY. Thank you so much. If you're not a subscriber, I hope that you will consider being a part of our family and join me on Tuesday mornings. I truly appreciate your time and your support and I look forward to seeing you later on today on my next DIY.